Hey, Amelia Mosley here. Let's check out today's news. Ariana Grande is one of the biggest celebrities on the planet. I mean, we see her picture everywhere. But now the pop star's in trouble for posting a photo of herself. Yep, yep, you can take as many pictures as you like. Having your picture taken constantly is a major part of being in the public eye. If you're really famous, it can be relentless. Newspapers, selfies, you don't even get a break to eat a chicken salad. Then, of course, there's social media. That's exactly what's got Ariana Grande in a pickle. You see, she posted two pictures of herself on Insta. The trouble is, the photos were taken by someone else, and that person is now suing her for something called copyright infringement. Copyright is a law that gives the owner of a work, like a book or website, the right to say how other people can use it. Even if you're the one who's in the photo, the person who took the snap usually has sole ownership of it. It seems the pop sensation didn't seek permission before posting it. Now the owner wants $36,000 for each photo. One thing's for sure, we should all be careful about what we post. School kids around the country are busy taking naplan tests this week, but some computer glitches are causing big issues. Around half of all Aussie schools are doing the tests online this year, but a lot of them have had trouble with things like logging in and bad connections. As you can imagine, that's been pretty stressful for everyone involved. Schools in Victoria have been told they can switch back to good old pen and paper, while other states are still working out what to do. In the next few years, we could be hearing about the first woman to set foot on the moon. NASA's just announced a big plan called Project Artemis, which aims to send a female astronaut on a lunar mission within the next five years. Artemis is named after the Greek goddess, twin sister of Apollo, which is what the original moon missions were named. The mission's going to test different technology and strategies that we could one day use on Mars, but it's gonna be expensive. So the US president says he wants to give NASA another 1.6 billion US dollars to make it happen. Over in Tel Aviv in Israel, the 2019 Eurovision Song Contest has kicked off and Australia's entry has put on a pretty spectacular performance. This was the performance by Australia's Kate miller Heidke. She's hitting the high notes while literally swaying through the air on a bendy pole. Wild, I know. And it's clearly working for her. She's been selected to continue on to the grand finals. I know what you're thinking. Australia isn't in Europe, so what are we doing here? Well, the European Broadcasting Union, which produces the event, invited Australia to compete back in 2015, because Aussies have always been really big fans. And we've made it back ever since. This year marks the 64th Eurovision Song Contest. And as always, it's a time for some questionable costumes, some pretty average dancing, and well, ooh, that's gotta hurt. Of course, there's more to come. The next semi-final will be tomorrow before the grand final this weekend. We'll keep you posted on how it all goes. Now for a segment with intentional and accidental superstars, because they've all been caught in the limelight. All the attention was on the players at this footy game, when one girl decided she'd rather have the eyes of the crowd. Two-year-old Pippa came pretty close to being trampled when a player scooped her up and carried her off just in time. Pitch invasion is a serious crime, but we think authorities will let Pippa off the hook just this once. When your parents are Kim Kardashian and Kanye West, you're probably not going to be the shy, quiet type. Little North West is captivating audiences with her debut as a director and choreographer. I got the horses in the back, horse stock is attached. She created this eclectic video clip for Lil Nas X's Old Town Road, which so far has no official clip. And honestly, fans are wondering if he really even needs one now. And speaking of being caught in the limelight, whoa, firefighters in the US managed to coax this daredevil kitty to jump after it got caught in a very high tree. It obviously wasn't a fan of the attention though, it bolted right out of there. Well, that's just about all we have time for, but let us know, do you think it's fair that you can be sued for posting a photo someone else took of you? Comment below and don't forget to like and subscribe.